Welcome back, collectors of magical merchandise everywhere. Last week, we unboxed the Gryffindor house wand stand from Harry Potter. And today, you can only stay if you have courage, loyalty, and bravery. Because we have the Gryffindor house wand. The Gryffindor house wand. If you're a Gryffindor, drop a comment down below. I'm going to be keeping track of points, and whoever has the most points wins the house cup! But I really like this box. The first thing I notice is this red stripe right here, kind of like a Gryffindor color. It's more of a maroon color if you ask me, but I like the box design. We got the Wizarding World Harry Potter exclusive design collectors right there. I really like the blackness of the box with the style of writing right there. And of course, we've got the Harry Potter trademark at the bottom. But what matters the most is what's inside. Okay, so right off the bat, we have a card. The card says, The Sword of Gryffindor. Inspired by the goblin-made sword of Godric Gryffindor, the Sword of Gryffindor wand is inset with ruby-like jewels and ornate metalwork evocative of the revered relic, a perfect symbol of courage and determination. This design is for those bravest at heart. And when we turn it over, we've got the Gryffindor lion on the back with all the trademark stuff down at the bottom. As we pull back the royal ribbons to reveal the Gryffindor house wand, we will take this out of the box like always, together. And here it is, the sword of Godric Gryffindor in the form of a wand. We've got the wand stand from the last video. We finally have the wand to match the stand. Let's go ahead and take a closer look. From the Harry Potter exclusive design collection, we have not only the house wand of Gryffindor and the form of the Sword of Gryffindor with all the intricate designs. This one screams royalty as we move down to the neck of the wand, all the way down to the shaft. And we can't forget, we have the matching Gryffindor house wand stand. I'm not gonna lie, having the Godric Sword of Gryffindor wand seated on its throne on this wand stand, it feels pretty good. But before we dive a little too deep, let me give you a closer look about how this wand sits on the stand. One of these things I don't really like about this stand is that the wand that isn't fully seated on the stand itself. And the stand offers absolutely zero protection for the wand. So if you're going to be taking this on and off the stand, I would do so with caution. If you're going to be putting it too far out, it is handle heavy and it will fall off this one is inspired by the sword of godric gryffindor and let me tell you the details we have here we have rubies right here down at the bottom of the neck of the wand almost down at the center and the details to this wand i'm gonna have to tell you this is a wand that video will not do it justice this is a wand that you're actually gonna have to go out and buy so i'll put a link down in my description for this one because i am telling you the video does this wand no justice we've got the gold handle and let me tell you what i am not a fan of gold but the gold on this one it just works i have unboxed a golden snitch one and let me tell you that one was a disappointment compared to this one. This one shouts royalty. The sword of Gryffindor played such a big part in Harry Potter and the destruction of Lord Voldemort. I can see why they put everything in this wand. It is such an amazing wand. They, the Noble Collection, the creators of this wand, did such an amazing job in capturing the detail and the royalty and the sleekness and really the respect that this wand deserves for the Gryffindor House wand. Now let's go ahead and measure the wand. It says it's an 18 inch wand and I'm actually willing to believe that, but we have to know for sure. And now we take our worn and tattered muggle measuring stick because they go to great lengths to avoid any type of magic. So now let's see if this wand is actually 18 inches. 
Ah, this wand is just shy of 14 and three quarter inches, which makes it right around 37 and a half centimeters. And now that we know this wand is 14 and three quarter inches, a little bit shy of 18, but still impressive. I gotta tell you, this wand is one of the most impressive wands that I have. Like I said, the video does not do it justice. The sword of Godric Gryffindor in the form of a wand. This thing is amazing. I was expecting something a lot different than this. I was expecting them to try to make the wand look like a sword. So I'm happy that they went with this route. I am very excited at the quality of this wand. I cannot say it enough. This is one of the best wands I have. And I think you should go down to the description and take a look for yourself and think about buying this wand because there's four house wands. We have Gryffindor, which is right here. Hufflepuff, Ravenclaw, and Slytherin. So there's four house wands, but the piece de resistance is the Hogwarts house wand stand and the Hogwarts house wand. So stay tuned. Again, if you're a Gryffindor, put a comment down below. I will be tallying up the scores and something will come of it.